Today, I'm gonna to show you a simple mindset hack that took me from making my first $21 in affiliate commissions to generating as much as $2,394 a day in my online business. Now, please note, this isn't a strategy video. If you want strategy videos, subscribe, click the bell, check out my other videos. This is about changing your mindset. And no, not like those woo-woo, fancy law of attraction videos that tell you to sit around and hope for money to come in your account. This is a real-world mindset change that you need to have right now if you plan on making money online. So stop whatever you're doing and stick with me the next eight minutes or so, and I guarantee this video will produce the exact mindset change that you need to have if you want to start profiting online. But you got to watch the whole video the way that it's presented. Don't skip around, don't move ahead, just watch the entire thing right now. First, let's take a look at some screenshots. This one here is the first automatic money I ever made. I had a simple website with a bunch of free reports on it. It looked like this. And I sold the whole package of the reports for $7.97. Now this commission is important because I made it back on July 4th of the year 2000. I remember it well because I was actually gone that day. I didn't work and back then we didn't have internet on our phones so I couldn't even check on what was happening. Plain and simple, I didn't do anything to earn this money. Now. I could have chalked this up as, hey, it's just 21 bucks. What are we going to buy a hamburger? But I decided to see things differently. This mindset change didn't happen right away. It actually took me a couple years to finally get it. Here are some more recent screenshots. This is one where I did over $569 in one day on one offer alone. Here's another one where I did $1,178 in one day. One where I did over $300 on a different offer in just one day. And this one I took just yesterday where I did over $6,097. And more importantly, here's one that just did $2.24 in one day. And another one that did $60.93 the same day. So why is it that the $2 and the $60 is more important than making like $6,000 in a day? Well, stick with me. The mindset change is about to happen. Now, in order to get this mindset change, you need to understand the difference between today's bank account and your future bank account. When I first started, I didn't understand this and I was all about making the fast money right now, which is important if you gotta live, but we gotta really focus on the future bank account if we wanna get big wins. The idea is that little wins equal big profits. So if you can get something to start generating money right now, it'll make big profits over time. Here's how it works. If we go with the Today Bank account, the way that I used to think about 20 years ago, we can look at it and say, hey, I can sit down and I can do work today and maybe I can make $100 or $50 or $500 or whatever it is. But the problem is, is tomorrow I need to do work again in order to get more money. So it kind of dies out. This is what we're taught with our job. You go to work, you get paid, and then tomorrow you got to go to work and the next day you got to go to work and you got to keep hoping that your job is there so that you can keep getting paid. Now, if we look at our future bank account, this is what people don't pay attention to because in our society, we are hardwired for the fast dollar now. But if I say, hey, instead of going to work and making my $100 today, what if instead I said, I want to go to work and I only want to focus my work today on making $3 a day every day. So I take my eight hours, I think, I work, I follow the videos here on the channel, I do what I gotta do to focus on making just $3 a day every day. Now, you might look at this and say, hey, this guy over here's got a dollar, or he's got his $100 from working, you only got three bucks. Marcus, are you a lunatic? Well, stick with me here. If I focus that one day on making $3 a day every day, sure, I get my three bucks today or maybe down the road or whatever it is, right? And then what happens is I get that same $3 every single day, even when I'm not working. Now, at the end of the year, this ends up being over $1,000. So if you're sitting there laughing saying, hey, I got my 100 bucks, Marcus only has three, then you're looking at this wrong and your mindset needs to change because I just sat down and found an easy way to make $3 a day every day. And the internet's a big place. Any of you guys can do it. 
That's why I showed you these screenshots at the beginning where I'm making like $2 and $7 and $60 so that you understand how this works. Because yesterday when I made the 6,000, it didn't all just come from one place. It came from lots of little wins that happened over time. Because here's the magic. So at the end of the year, I put over $1,097, if we can spell this right here, $1,097 into my future bank account. Now, the cool thing about this is I'm just focusing on $3 a day. If I do that again tomorrow and I say, okay, tomorrow I'm going to make a piece of content, a video, whatever it is, and I'm going to make another $3 a day, that's another $1,000 added to our bank account per year. And we keep doing this and keep doing this and keep doing it. And if you want to do it and make $50,000 a year, work for 50 days. Now, the secret here is that not everything you do is going to produce exactly $3 a day. Some of it will make like 10 cents. Some of it will make $100 a day or more. Some of them I've done have made over $2,000 a day from just one piece of content. The magic is in the numbers. So what we got to do is we got to get away from the mindset of thinking, how do I get the quick buck today and start thinking long term because we're building a business that's going to happen overall and build something big that's going to pay you over and over. Think about a supermarket. We go to the supermarket, we see eggs, we see milk, we see cereal, we see granola bars, we see grapes and apples and oranges and soda at the checkout aisle and gum and tabloids. Now, some of these grocery stores are making hundreds of thousands of dollars in sales every single day. But do they make that much just off of a pack of gum or milk or eggs? Of course not. They're making money by selling multiple items at the same time. If you only had one item, you wouldn't make the money. Much like your websites, your videos, your YouTube channel, your paid ads, whatever it is, you got to have multiple points of entry. And these points of entry can be anything from a blog post to reviews on different websites, Pinterest images, Instagram images, Facebook posts, YouTube videos, little reports, videos, files, emails, eBooks and PDFs, audio recordings, infographics, and more. And each of these little pieces of content, if you structure it right and you say, my goal today is to make $3 a day on average every day, then you can sit down and you can make these the right way. Now, a lot of people come to this keyword tool and they look at YouTube and everything and they look at these keywords saying, hey, how can I find a keyword that's going to make me $10,000 a month? And the answer is you probably can't. But can I take something like can you write off home improvements that gets 400 searches each and every month and get those people to my site and make money? Well, if I have 400 searches a month, that would be about 15 people a day coming to my website. Now, if I can make just 10 cents or 20 cents per visitor, which I know I can because this is in the tax market and tax ads and tax offers pay lots of money, then I can generate myself 4, 10, 20, or even more per day off this one piece of content. Again, the idea is to sit down and make deliberate content based on this traffic. So... When people look at this, I don't look at it as just keywords like everyone else. I actually look at this as inventory that's going to put money into my future bank account. So we want to go through and we want to try to find all the things that people are searching for that lead to what we have to offer. If it's a weight loss program, if it's a tax program, if it's something for loans, whatever it is, we want to go for the keywords and we want to build and grow as we go along. And this is going to fund your future bank account. And the cool thing about it is it's not that hard to do. I can make a simple video about how to write off home improvements, and then I could tell them to go to my website to learn about how to prepare their own taxes or the best software to use for their taxes or whatever it is, and I can get paid. Heck, I can even get paid with YouTube monetization and probably make a couple bucks a day on that video alone if I do it right. And the name of the game is that all of this stuff is going to start to add up. Now, instead of focusing on how to make that big, fast money right now today, we want to focus on little tiny wins that are going to add up over time. And some of these you might do really well with. You might hit on a keyword that makes you $100 a day. You might hit on one that makes $1,000 a day. I've seen it done many, many times. Now, again, remember, this is your inventory. This is like the grocery store shelf where you have the Clorox, right? And they go and they buy the Clorox and you get paid. And 
in order to make lots of money, you got to have bread and you got to have meat and you got to have lettuce and all this other stuff. And over time, all of this stuff is going to add up and make you lots of money if you do it right. Now, again, remember, the results are not typical, implied, or guaranteed. I have no idea what you're going to make. The average person makes nothing. But I think if you start to change your mindset from how do I make $10,000 a month to how can I make $3 a day or $10 a day or $50 a day, things are going to start to change for you because you're now going to make this money every single day. And it's kind of like the old tortoise and the hare. And the hare is trying to stack money into his bank account right now. And he takes breaks and he gets lazy and he gets bummed out because he's not getting where he needs to go. But he thinks, hey, if I keep doing this, I'm going to make money. On the other hand, the tortoise is over here stacking up little wins, putting them into his future bank account. People don't want to do this. Everyone wants to make a million dollars tomorrow. And I'll tell you right now, the way to make a million dollars tomorrow is to figure out how to make a little bit each and every day and grow. For example, a million dollars is only $2,700 a day. Can you make pieces of content that will generate on average $2,700 a day? Yes, you can. I've actually done it. And the secret to making this work is persistence. You have to persist and you have to be deliberate. We can't go for keywords we don't think we're going to get. I'm not going to go out there and go for tax write-offs. I'm going to go for the smaller stuff that I know I can get. I'm going to make a good piece of content that is designed to move my visitor from my video or my article or my blog post or my review to my website or whatever it is that pays me money. I need to get that visitor to do that. So before I sit down and create this content, I need to ask myself, what are they going to do? If I'm going to go for how to write off home improvements, is there a tax software or accountant or something that teaches them about this that I can promote that's going to pay me money? If I'm going for writing off mortgage interest, can I go for this and do it in a way that's going to work? And to show you an example of this, on my website, I have many different keyword rankings. What I do is I create little rankings based on what people search for. Now, this here is a little win. If you look at Lyft Affiliate Program, the competition is low, and it gets about 250 searches a month, which means people search for this in Google, they click on my link every day, and they buy stuff. So if this one article that I actually outsourced, I didn't even write it myself, can get me two or three sales a month, that's $1,000 a month from one little post that I paid someone else to write. And you can see here, it actually ranks in Google. You click it, it looks pretty simple, and it leads people into the stuff that makes me money. Another example is with a YouTube video I did, which actually has one of the screenshots that we showed in the beginning. This video actually ranks for Honey App Money. You can see that our video ranks right here. We get views every single day. It makes money with monetization, and it makes money when people subscribe and check out my other videos about how to make money online. This is extremely simple to do, and we need to get our mindset away from trying to jump the entire staircase in one full swoop, and we need to take it one step at a time. How can I build something today that's going to make me a dollar, three dollars, ten dollars, or more each and every day? And this is the miracle of compound interest. I think it was Albert Einstein who said that compound interest is the most powerful force in the entire universe. And we've seen all the screenshots that say if you have a penny and you double it every day, at the end of the month, you're going to have like $4 million. Now, while that is extreme, and I don't think you're going to make $4 million in the next 30 days, you can start by doing something simple. Start now. Focus on a niche of people that are searching for things. Make videos, content, PDF, articles, press releases, make ebooks, videos, whatever it is that'll put you in front of these people, start to do that and focus on your future bank account. Sure, there are things that you can do today to make $100 or more online, but again, when you stop working, the money stops coming. So if you want to grow a true passive income, start by doing small little wins and look at how they add up. Just remember, if I do 100 things that pay me $3 a day, I'm now making $100,000 a year just by focusing on three bucks. And if you do this over and over, you will start to get the results. You'll grow, you'll get better, you'll start to understand your audience more, you'll start to understand how to convert better, and you will grow something that'll make money for years to come. 
Thanks for watching this video, and I hope you had that mindset shift from looking at today's bank account and looking at things as inventory, looking at your keywords as inventory, your videos as inventory, as little things that are going to pay you each and every day, even when you're not working. This was the miracle that changed in my mind that allowed me to make over $10 million on the internet with no college education, barely graduating high school, and I think it can help you too. Make sure you subscribe, click the bell, and check out the next video on passive income.